Hey everybody, welcome back. And I am back with a, another Dollar Tree haul. Um, this one was kind of inadvertent. <laughs> um, I went in just to get some tissue paper and ribbon. And one, two, three, four, five, six, like seven bags later, we have a haul. So, let's get started. This is actually um, two different Dollar Trees. So, here is, of course, the tissue paper. Um, I love this for Poshmark because it has solid color. It has um, some patterns. And actually, this is the real reason I went in was to get pancake mix. Last weekend, I wanted pancakes and realized I did not have any pancake mix, um, which is weird because I usually do. So I didn't feel like going to the grocery store. So I was like, let me just go to Dollar Tree. So they did have it, believe it or not. It's Harvest Hill. Um, it's light and fluffy pancake and waffle complete buttermilk mix. It's 16.5 ounces. My favorite part about this is just add water. Um, I don't always have eggs in the house. Actually, I very rarely have eggs in the house. Um, just because we don't we don't eat them you know like if I bake something I might use an egg but not enough to require having a dozen or even half a dozen eggs in the house so I like that this is just add water so excited that they had that then of course I had to grab some more of my Poshmark notes I didn't buy them all out this time because I do have quite a few. I try to get a couple packages every time I go, um, but I didn't buy them out. I just bought three packages. I figured let somebody else have them. Then, of course, as they get me at the register, Snickers and Kit Kat. Um, another repurchase is this tape. I know I've said it before. Um, this is the Tool Bench Ultra Clear Tape. I use this for sealing up the packages good tape so far and I just grabbed two ribbon two ribbons these are the um, sheer ribbon and it is three yards they're both three yards and it's like ombre and then this is ombre oh no it's not this is just oh it might be ombre two different color blues um the Dollar Tree that I got these at had a whole bunch of ribbon, way more than they usually do. It was like, you know, like the narrow boxes and there were so many of them. They had the lace, that off-white lace, lace ribbon that I love, um, but I have so much of that. So next time I'll probably grab some, not the whole entire thing, but I might grab some. So then I saw this, and of course, you know I had to get it. It says Unicorn Crossing, and so it has this little um, rope hanger, or it has, um, I don't know what these, like the hooks, so that if you wanted to hang it, but it's like sparkly. And it was so funny, because I totally bought this for myself, and the cashier was like, oh, she's like, aren't these cute? She's like, oh, she's like, it goes with the theme in my daughter's room. And I'm like, <laughs> feeling like a complete 12 year old standing in line. But I love unicorns and anything unicorn. So I'm going to put this in my room probably, but that's okay. Then I saw these stickers. So Peel and stick, whim decal. So this one says unicorns are my spirit animal. And it's just two different sizes of that. And then there's some rainbow unicorns. Um, this actually shows like a laptop. And that looks like a back of an iPhone. So I'm thinking maybe I will get um, a plain case for my phone and then just put these stickers on there. Uh, right now I have one with llamas on it and then I also have one of those 
pop socket things on the back of my phone. And then these are also the peel and stick um, whim decals. This one is a pineapple and it says stand tall, wear a crown. So each one of these sheets is a dollar, but it's a pretty big sticker. And I feel like if you went to Five Below or um, anywhere else, like Dollar General, like I, Michael's, I don't know if they would sell these there, but I feel like they would be way more expensive. So I grabbed that and then I absolutely love this one. It says be amazing with the diamond and like look how shiny it is. So I grabbed two of those. So these I actually grabbed for um, Poshmark. I kind of want to start doing um, like including little gifts if someone buys like a bundle. Um, normally, I don't, when, I, when I say bundle, I don't mean just like two things. Bundling like if someone buys like three or four or five things and makes a bundle. I wanted to just throw you know, just throw something in. So I got these stickers. The unicorn one, obviously, is for me. And then also, I've passed on these a couple times, but this time I decided to get them. These are the um, the cat keychains, and they're like the poof ball ones. They did have the ones that looked like a flower. Um, I don't know. It, they looked weird, but look at this color. I absolutely, it's like a dusty rose color. That's like one of my, my favorite colors. Um, so I grabbed this one. So it has this keychain part and then it actually has the little clip part here. So I grabbed this one for myself and then also for Poshmark bundles, um, I grabbed the blue, the dark blue cap, and then I also grabbed the light blue cat, and these are just so cute. You know, I'm not trying to include anything that costs like a ton of money, just kind of like a little thank you, and I think those are super cute. Even if they don't use them as keychains, like just to hang it up somewhere, it's super cute. Um, so then I saw these, I've never seen these before. Um, they're the makeup wipes and I don't know it says with cucumber and aloe you get 30 wipes and the brand looks like it's FY um, distributed by my spa life New Jersey um, so I think Dollar Tree carries a lot of my spa life if I'm not mistaken I think I've seen other stuff there so 30 wipes so I got two of those. Do I need them? No, because I have tons from couponing. Um, but I did realize I was starting to run a little bit low, so I wanted to grab these. I don't know. I don't want to open it because I just opened a package. I just started, a, you know, a different package. And so I don't want to... I'll open it. Ooh, they smell good. They kind of smell like hand wipes, though. Like... I don't know why they would smell like lemon and they're not lemon. Alrighty. So I did but again at the register they got me with this unicorn cookie pop. Um it just says decorated cookie pop. Um artificially flavored. I'm guessing it's like a sugar cookie. I guess it's like a sugar cookie. My favorite is dumping her food all over the place. Um, then I love socks. Socks is like one of my favorite things. But I grabbed these just because I like the colors. Like this reminds me so much of like the 80s. Like the orange, the yellow, and the pink. But they are crew socks. It's size 5 to 9. I don't know if they had any other sizes. So it's like the longer socks, but they had a couple different colors. I just got this one color, but super excited. They feel really heavy, like good for the, the winter. So I grabbed one pair of those. And then of course my other favorite thing is scarves. Um, just winter gear in general, but this is more of like a fall scarf. 
So this is the infinity scarf. So now they have these really great patterns and this has <laughs> um, feathers on it and I just really, really liked it. I thought that would be really pretty to like. Amelia! She's scraping up the cage. So I thought that was really pretty. So I grabbed that one. And then of course they have Halloween scarves. And absolutely, as much as I love unicorns, I love skulls. So of course I couldn't pass this skull scarf by. This one's not an infinity. This is a regular, a regular scarf, but they had ones with like spiders and then orange ones. And then of course I grabbed some skull socks. These are size five to nine. Um, definitely check the size because they have kids socks that look exactly like this. And I almost didn't get them because I thought they were all really small sizes. But I had to dig and then, because you know, they're, I don't know, my store, they're on like a rack on the end and they're all just like piled on top of each other. So these are bright orange. They have the skull and then the foot part, like the heel and the toe have this really great like rose decoration. So super excited about those and then I was able to find some more of the nails so I grabbed the red and black because I will wear the red and black all year round so I grabbed two more of those nails is something I will always buy because I literally always have nails on like I think I've said it before, very rarely do I not have nails on, maybe on the weekend when I know I'm not going anywhere, I'll take my nails off and give them a break. Um, and then I will paint them. Very rarely do I ever not have anything on. So, oh my God, I am super excited <laughs> about, they don't smell either, which is good. Sometimes they have that weird like plasticky smell. Um, these emoji pillows. Oh my god. So I only found these at one of my Dollar Trees and I honestly wasn't even expecting to find these. Um, so they had this one which is the angry face and I have to tell you they are really really soft. Like this is perfect for like um, for reading like when I read this is oh my god they're so soft. I was shocked that they were this soft. So they had um, and it's like it's a big pillow like it's pretty good size so they had this one they had um a cookie there's only one cookie and they had that one they had the cookie and then this one I am super excited about this one this is probably one of my most used emojis in real life um and it's super soft I actually grabbed two of these because I got one of these for um, a co-worker and she doesn't know about it yet and this is one of our excuse me one of our emojis that we use to each other all the time so this was literally so perfect so I got two of those so those were the only three that they had and and I like I said I only found them at one of my stores and it was right when you walk in they actually weren't in I don't know if your guys stores have them where it's like the deal of the day or the deal of the week I think it is and it's in like a white wire rack and that's whatever it is um this was actually in a very long box just like randomly in the middle of the floor and it had um like maybe two or three of the red ones three or four of the purple and like one cookie and I walk the rest of the store and I didn't see any different ones, so I'm not sure if there's other styles or anything, but I was pretty excited <laughs> to find them, in all honesty. Okay, so then I grabbed my son one of these, which is the um, glow ball. I got the blue one. He likes the glow stuff. 
And then another thing I am super excited about, this whole, um, this whole haul, like, I'm really excited about. Um, I found one squishy, like, randomly by itself. And when I saw this one, I literally went back to where the toys were, went up and down the toy section. This one was actually by, um, the rack in the front that has all, like, the extra, like, where I found these, like, the keychains. I don't know what they call it. Has all, like, the cool stuff on it. The cool rack is what I call it. Um, but it does smell not, not like pineapple. It kind of smells like pine salt, like a cleaning. But, oh my god. I love my squishies. And to be able to get this one for a dollar, I really wish they had more. Um, so this was either laying around or, like, they had them. And I, this is the last one, or this one just happened to be laying around, but I had never seen them there before. I think I missed the boat on these when they were there. But I did get one, and that's good enough for me. Um, also, something else I am super excited about. And let me just tell you how excited I am. Like, this is how excited I am. These are all nails. And a side note, some of these are for me. Just saying. Um, so as you can see, I have these nails on. Before this, I had the red ones on. And I absolutely love them. Um, the red ones, however, one popped off and I lost it. I think it was somewhere at Dunkin' Donuts. I'm not 100% sure. So I had to take them all off. But before that, um, the color actually started to wear down. Um, because I type all day and this is like my most used finger for like dialing the phone and all this. So, um, the red started to come off. I probably could have touched it up maybe with um, like a marker or some nail polish but because I lost that one I just took them off and then I put these on and these are starting to wear down a little bit they've been on for about a week so I was super excited to find new ones that I had not seen the last time last time I went I had grabbed two different kinds and I know I had missed the boat on them like I know there was other styles because they never just have two styles there's at least three or four um so this time I grabbed two of each I probably should have grabbed more um but these that one has something on it that's kind of gross um so these are like a marble so it's like um like a pearl a pearl white or maybe like a silver like a pearl white and a silver marble I don't know if you're going to be able to, to see that. There we go. That's probably better. So the only reason I got these is because that the white doesn't look like it's clear. It looks like it's a pearl color. So you don't worry about seeing your nail through it. So I grabbed two packages of those. Um, these I'm pretty sure we had before. I only grabbed one. Um, it's the kind of like a, a coral color with the white roses. I don't know what's the best way to see this because there's like a mirror in the back of it. And then these I do not remember seeing. These are like a peach color um, with some like white designs. I don't know if you can see that. So I liked those. Oops. And then these actually might be my favorite. These are uh, white and black and there's like some black um, detail. But I just really like the way that it looks. So it looks like there's some accent nails in there. Um, with these though, I you get 12. Obviously there's no glue. You get 12, but I actually use all of them except the really gigantic ones that I guess are made for your thumb so I don't so none of these will end up being accent nails like I'm gonna have to wear them all because of the the size it's just the really big thumbnails 
um, that I don't use. So that's going to be pretty cool. I'm not sure which style is the really big. It looks like the white is the really big, like the plain one. So I don't know. We'll have to see. And then I know we grabbed these last year. These are the glow in the dark nails, which because of the color, you can honestly use all year round, but these tend to come out um, around Halloween. So I grabbed two of each color because I'm going to give one set um, to one of my co-workers. Oh no, did I grab? I may not have grabbed all of them. Um, oh no, I did. Okay, so there are, there is purple. So there you go. It's like a pastel. I like the colors even without them glowing in the dark. This is a pink. It's like a pastel pink. There is also a blue. And then there is an orange. Which you can see the difference between the, the pink and the orange. So I think those are the only colors. There may be a green, but I did not see a green one there. Uh, we have a couple more repurchases here. Um, you've got these, the um, Aunt Asses. I've said it before and I will keep saying it. I live by these. This is going to work with me. Uh, also another repurchase is the Tea Vive Peppermint Tea. I was actually completely out of that. And then the Tea Vive Chamomile, always a repur repurchase as well. And then I found these, oven baked fudge mint cookies. So to me, they kind of look like the Girl Scouts um, Thin Mints is exactly how it looked. And I'm trying to remember, I did buy um, bootleg Thin Mints at Family Do no, Dollar General. And I'm trying to remember if it was the oven baked brand, but those were really good. And we missed the Girl Scout cookies this year. Um, I had put in a huge order and the person I put the order in claims that they lost everybody's order. So none of us got cookies. Uh, it was very disturbing. I was very distraught. Like I look forward to Girl Scout cookies every year and to be told I'm not getting them. Uh, way after the time to put the order in so we couldn't even go for anybody else and get cookies was kind of upsetting. So if these taste like like the Thin Mints from the Girl Scouts that would be amazing. So I grabbed two boxes because I'd never seen them before and usually when they get new stuff um, it goes really fast. Like word gets around I guess and it like flies out the door. Alright we did have so I was trying to look in the books, but this lady had her carriage in the way and she was like tearing the book section apart. Books were dropping all over the place. She was like reaching and throwing stuff off the shelves. It was insane. But I was able to find some new coloring books. I was only able to find three and I honestly think this is all that they had. I didn't see any other ones. Um, but this one is Stress Less Color by Number Flowers. Um, 75 coloring pages for peace and relaxation. So this one is color by number. So I can do a pattern like this if it's telling me what color to do. I don't get as overwhelmed as like some of those um, uh, mandala pages see so then it tells you what it's supposed to look like some of those like mandala ones like stress me out but I like these the color by by numbers that to me makes it stressless is when I know what color I'm supposed to color it so I grabbed that one I don't even know what I grabbed I was just trying to get the hell out of there so I didn't get hit by any books um Ruth Heller's coloring pad what did I even buy? Oh, this is kind of neat. Ooh, there's like seashells. Okay, so this one says Ruth Heller's Seasons Coloring Art Pad. 
apparently there's this one too which I don't know if they had because I couldn't I couldn't get over there um and these are really cool so they tear off from the top and uh, I really like those there's leaves and seashells and oh my god everything I love is in here um so this was originally $9.99 $9.99 I don't know if this one had a price um it only has a Canada price oh no that $14.99 this one was $14.99. This one was $9.99. It's crazy how expensive coloring books are. And then this one I was super excited about. Every little thing. This is another really big one. And this is the same thing. It has like seashells and like weird little like chickens. I don't know. This is kind of interesting. Oh, look at there's little, like, little animals. Look at there's little fuzz butts in there. This is very interesting. Oh my god. Alligators with boom boxes. This is everything right now. I like this. Alright, so this one is. Um. $15.99. This is something I feel like you would see at Barnes and Noble. Um, but it says, from a retro dreamscape of candy toys and typewriters to a joyful parade of woodland creatures, each page of this hand-drawn coloring book is its own kaleidoscope-like universe. Um, I am super excited. Oh my god. This is really cool. This is a coloring book I can get behind. So that's super exciting. I don't know if I would roll into a store and pay $16 for it, but... Um, oh look, I did buy two. Oh, and then I grabbed one package. I did must have grabbed another package of red. Why not? Okay, and here is another reason that I went in. And I grabbed two of everything because another set is going to um, a co-worker. So these are the Super Tips washable markers. You get five. These are the classic colors. Um, so you get red, orange, yellow, blue, and green. They are the Crayola brand. These are the bold colors and you get five. So it's magenta, sun yellow, grass green, light blue, and violet. So I grabbed four of those all together. And then this was really my reason for going to this other specific Dollar Tree was to see if they had these crayons. And they did. These are the glitter crayons. So you get eight of them um, and it's assorted colors. So there's your colors, but they are glitter. Crayola knows what it's doing. And then my personal favorite is the neon crayons. And you get eight. It doesn't say, it doesn't have a list of what colors, but let's just open this up here. And there are your neon colors. Super excited about these neon crayons. I remember having these when I was little, they were a big thing. And then I guess they went away and now they are back. So you get eight crayons. So pretty successful Dollar Tree I will say with lots of really great stuff super excited um yeah so that is my haul thank you so so much for watching don't forget to like this video don't forget to subscribe before you leave don't forget to check it down below in the description box I will have tons of coupon codes for you to save money while you're shopping for thread up for to try stitch fix um I think I might have a color pop code in there um the real real uh there's a code down there and then also don't forget my Poshmark closet follow that link down below um that will take you to my closet so you could check out what I have for sale and then also it will give you um coupon code to shop I don't know how much it is I believe it's five dollars but I'm not 100% sure but just click it check it out 
Thank you so, so much for watching and until the next one.